Good morning guys and welcome back. Welcome back to the channel. Um, this is the last video, the last video of the cutting vlogs. Uh, for those of you who've watched the whole the whole series, man, thank you so much. Uh, unless you're into all this uh, uh, cutting and, and dieting stuff and exercise and all that stuff, maybe it was a bit boring, all these conversations. Uh, but you know, maybe I made you laugh a couple times. Uh, perhaps uh, maybe you'll feel a little bit inspired to uh, get get healthy and maybe lose uh, a few pounds if you if you have to or if you need to or if you want to, whatever it is. But uh, guys, before we get into uh, uh, everything, uh, wrap this whole thing up. Uh, I think I think it's time, guys, that I level up my game. And yeah, I'm pretty sure that you guys know what it is I'm talking about. So let's go. So yeah, guys, uh, yeah, I'm sure you had no idea what it is I was talking about. But yeah, I'm going to try to level up my coffee game. Uh, you guys know how I enjoy the, the whole process. Uh, I'm going to try to learn a little bit more about, because uh, you guys know I always just drink drip coffee, you know, regular American drip coffee. So, I mean, not always, but uh, what, what I make at home usually is that. But I am going to get more into into espresso and learning the whole you know the whole science behind that process so you'll see some i'm sure you'll see some little clips and little videos here and there where i'll add some of that stuff and if you guys want to talk about that you know just let me know and and uh maybe we'll do a couple videos on that anyway uh I, oh and by the way i do still plan on making that um uh, the the review of the best coffee shops from around town but as you guys know, Miami is again like locking down. We're now the epicenter of the whole pandemic. <laughs> Man. You know, I'm surprised it took this long. But uh, wow, I hope everybody out there is staying safe and staying healthy and that nothing, you know, that there's no uh, anything bad happening to anybody's friends or family members out there. Anyway, man, I, I just can't wait for this whole thing to be over and I'm sure you guys feel the same way. But anyway let's talk about the cut and what it is that I learned this time okay because every time I do this uh, I learn something new I, I, I get it, it feels like I get better at it and it gets easier okay so this cut was fast it was fairly easy I did have a few days where uh, maybe normally I would have just called it quits because I was already lean enough but uh, I push through to just kind of like you know reach a new a new level of leanness and a, and a and a new best effort and you know just trying to make progress. So 
what did I learn? Well, I learned that it's, it, you know, it, it gets easier the more you try it, the more you do it. I don't know if it is that maybe your body gets used to being leaner, uh, little by little, maybe. Um, for sure, there's new foods that you find that help you and new ways of doing things, uh, f uh, meal prep and things like that. And that goes a long way because uh, having your meals ready or things that you can make quickly, at least for me, that's that's huge. That's huge. Um, so yeah, um, that's a big part of it. Um, so I think I reached my goal. I definitely got to the leanest uh, I've ever been by uh, by the scale. I mean, you guys saw the last weigh, and that's the leanest I've ever <laughs> I've ever been in my adult life. And um, I was happy with the results, you know. If that's the best I could ever do, then so be it. You know, I'm happy with that. Uh, I think I'm um, perhaps in the best shape I've ever been in my life, you know. So I'm, I'm happy with the results. Uh, I do want to improve on it, and I am going to keep striving to, to, you know, do better the next time. And I will do again uh, another cut next year. Um, hopefully, I'll start again in April. So you guys saw that I, um, it took me eight weeks and the, my last weigh-in was, I believe it was June 15th. And, uh, and you know, I told myself that I, I'm sorry, not June 15th, it was May 15th because, well, today's July 16th. It's been, it's been a while since the cut, okay? So uh, it took long to put all these videos. Each video covered only like two or three days. So that's how it worked out. So yeah, today is uh, July Thursday, July 16th, and I finished dieting on May 15th. So like, wow, two months ago already. And since then, I've put on four pounds, a whole four four pounds, and uh, it's I've been able to uh, stay the leanest, the leanest ever uh, from any of the cuts, and the easiest by, uh, by far. It's been easy to just you know, to not like overeat or go crazy or regain weight. Um, it, maybe because, you know, I planned it out and I did it slow and I didn't kill myself uh, as I was dropping the, the weight. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe, like I said, you just get used to it. Uh, your body starts to get used to being leaner. I don't know. But all I know is that it was the easiest uh, to maintain so far. And you, and, and I even went on, on a crazy Tampa weekend food review. <laughs> I ate like crazy. I came back and I was up like seven, eight pounds. But then I started eating normal and I dropped half of that weight. You know, most of that, you know, is water weight. So on this morning's weigh-in, I was up four pounds from the leanest I've ever been in my life or in my adult life. And uh, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm happy with the results. Um, I hope you guys got something out of this whole uh, process and maybe you and you enjoy these talks uh, let me know you know and if you guys know of any coffee shops that I should visit when I start getting into this uh, whole uh, review of the different coffee shops let me know because uh, I have a few in mind uh, and I, I know of some of the most popular ones around town that I plan to visit but let me know and we'll do a, a series on that so if you guys need help with with this whole thing if you want to uh, get into into this a little bit or if you just want to drop 10 pounds you know let me know if you need any help any ideas uh, drop me a, an email or send me a dm on instagram and um man I, I enjoyed making these videos i really did like it i it was cool um next year i'm gonna diet down again now i don't have to worry about you know uh putting on more weight because if you never go on a cut and you never at least for me you know to, you're just gonna keep going up either that or you have to eat like a robot and never enjoy yourself because if you're going out to to eat with friends and you're gonna just you know go in one day and eat pizza and donuts and ice cream and all that kind of stuff and you never cut you never do some kind of time when you're when you're purposely trying to get back down to to your leanest or to where you were or whatever it is however it is you decide to do it you know little by little you're just gonna keep gaining weight which is what happened to me. And if you're not into lifting and going to the gym and all that, then you're gonna start losing muscle and you're gonna just be more out of shape as time goes. It's just what happens, you know? So I plan to keep doing this. I feel great. Um, 
I hope you guys enjoy these uh, vlogs. Uh, let me know. Drop me a, a message on this. Please like the video. Uh, give it a like. And uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. So I will be posting some uh, pictures of uh, the results. And at least the best pictures I could get. Um, of, the, of the end results of the cutting vlogs. Uh, I will post them on my Instagram. At Omnio Capote. It's just my name. Uh, check it out. Uh, join the Instagram team if you haven't done so already. And I'll see you guys on the next one.